Comfort Bokomensa was active in the days of Dr. Kwame Nkrumah. She says in her search for someone to help her get education, she eventually came in contact with Osajefo Dr. Kwame Nkrumah. She later received a three-month training to drive tractors in the Workers' Brigade, making her the first female to do so in 1961. <laughs> Nkuma handed me over to one cotton of the workers' brigade to assist me with work. I eventually drove a tractor called Zeto. It had six gears. Madame Comfort Boko said when some persons tried to poison Dr. Nkrumah while he was at the James Fort prison, she was the one who was sent to deliver a message sealed in a toilet roll to some officials at the prison. She tells me she was arrested and sent to prison three times. <laughs> Some persons came, asking me of the woman I was staying with. They took me away and I spent six weeks in prison. The mother of eight was a cheerleader in the CPP. The 80-year-old is, however, not happy with the level of partisanship in the country's body politic. Ghana would not develop with this kind of partisanship. Ghana, any 